This is Anil with a video tutorial for the learning lad on C programming. So in this video tutorial we're gonna see how we can pass the address of a structure variable to a function. So in this tutorial for the demonstration purpose I have defined a structure called student. As a members of this structure we have a name which is a character array and a roll number which is of type integer. So so first we're going to create the variable of this structure student. It's going to be struct student and the variable name. Let's call it Anil. So okay, we're going to assign it here also. It's going to be Anil. Then now uh, roll number. Let's call it one two three four. So now we have a structure variable Anil with the values Anil and uh, one two three four. So now we're going to create a function which is going to take the address of a structure of type student. It's going to be void. Let's call it display. Then uh, as a parameter it's going to take the address. That's why we're going to write a pointer here. It's going to be struct student. Let's call it ptr. So since it's a pointer we have to add the star here. So in this display function we're going to use a printf statement and we're going to print the values we receive. So it's going to be percentage %s and a tab then uh, percentage %d. So here we're going to refer the elements or the members of the structure variable that we received through this pointer. So it's going to be ptr and uh, when accessing the elements or a member of a structure variable through pointer we have to use this arrow operator then the member or the element is going to be name then ptr then the arrow operator and then another member it's going to be roll number so this is it so in our main function we need to call that display function it's going to be display and as a parameter we have to pass the address of the structure variable anil so i'm going to pass ampersand anil so save it before that we have to prototype this function display that's why I'm gonna copy this and paste it after this st structure definition that's because you know in function prototyping we are using that uh, you know struct student so I'm gonna paste it here and a semicolon so I'm gonna save it compile it and run it so as you can see here we are printing anil1234 so let's have a recap so first we define our structure student and then we prototype our display function and this display function is gonna take the address of our structure variable so in this main function we initialized our structure variable and we pass the address of the structure variable to this function so and in that display function we just display the elements or the members of the structure variable we received as a pointer so this is it this is about uh, passing structure address to a function so thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe i'll see you in the next tutorial